Hi students, welcome to the fourth tutorial of the chapter Applications of Trigonometry. E tutorial lo manam textbook lo unnatuvanti example 6 and example 7 ki sambandhinchinatuvanti solutions chuddam. Please subscribe to my channel for more videos on class 10 mathematics. Let us look at the problem. This is your example 6. Two men on either side of a temple of 30 meter height observe its top at the angles of elevation 30 degrees and 60 degrees respectively. Find the distance between the two men. So, here we have a temple and there are two men on either side of the temple. So, height of the temple is given as 30 meter. So, 30 meter height in the temple on the a temple ki rendu vaipla, there are two observers and these two looked at the top of the temple with angles of elevation 30 degrees and 60 degrees. So, ante this is a very, very distance in the temple. If you have a very okay distance, you will have angles of elevation equal. But they are at different distances from the temple. And they will have angles of elevation different. So, we will have a diagram of this. In this case, their angles of elevation are 30 and 60. If you have a left side of the angle of elevation 30, this is a right side of the angle of elevation 30 degrees. This is a very good thing. मानो ये दना को ऑब्जेक्ट नहीं एंगल फिलिवेशन तो चूस तो ना पड़ो व्हेन यू आर लुकिंग एट एन ऑब्जेक्ट व्हिच इज एट हाईर लेवल दैन योर आईसाइट मानो दान के अंतर दैगर का उन्हें मान एंगल फिलिवेशन को डांट तो पैर गुता उन्हें सो मेरा को ट्री नहीं लेता को बिल्डिंग ने दौरने चूसेरन कोण्टे Angle of elevation will be more for the person who is nearer to the temple. So, temple के दग्गर का उन्ना वाला तालप पाई के ते कुछ उड़ाल गा बटे वाला angle of elevation एक्कु गाउंट द। So here you have to take angle of elevation of the left hand person और ये यावर नहीं थे मानो दो रंगा चुपिस ना हम डायग्राम लो वाला thirty अदे वे दंगा यावर नहीं थे दग्गर का चुपिन चे हम टेम्पल के वाला angle of elevation sixty का तीस कॉल। So this is the situation we have and we have to find the distance between the two observers। वे दर मज़ूर उन्टे distance माने calculate चाहिए। so here we have two angles of elevation and we also have the height of the temple. Let us try to draw the diagram for this situation. Suppose this is a level ground and A and B are the two observers. CD is the temple whose height is 30 meter. A the Ginichi angle of elevation 30 degrees and from B the angle of elevation is 60 degrees. Now you have to find the distance from A to B. That means you have to calculate the value of AB. Man dekhe ronte mante problem no AMM information though. First, Dhanradham. So, here we have CD is the height of the temple that is 30 meter. A and B are the two observers. Angle DAC is the angle of elevation of the temple from A that is 30 degrees. This is the angle DAC. Okay. Similarly, angle DBC is the angle of elevation of the temple from B and that angle is equal to 60 degrees. We will calculate the distance between A and B. मेरे कड़ ये भी नहीं चूसना चाहिए थे। It's actually divided into two parts. One is from A to C, A C, and the other is from C to B, C B. So मानो A C ने C B ने calculate चाहिए थे। रेंडु प्लस चाहिए थे नहीं थे। We can find the distance between A and B. So मानो ये problem ये विदंगा छोड़ा। In the previous exercise, we dealt with the problems which have only one right triangle। कहने कड़ मान के two right angle triangles होने। so, our end right angle triangles to angles of elevation use shares could not like a problem shall easy to solve it. Now, consider the triangle. First one angle ACD. The first triangle consider here we have angle 30 degrees and for 30 this is actually opposite side and I want AC. So, triangle ACD I have to calculate AC. But AC angle 30 degrees came out of the it's actually adjacent side. Now, here we have opposite. I want to calculate adjacent using the angle 30 degrees. So, opposite by adjacent, you have to make use of tan. Cot could have used change. It's okay. Now, I'll take tan 30 degrees is opposite by adjacent. As we know, opposite is CD, adjacent is AC. How much is tan 30 degrees? It's actually 1 by root 3. So, on the left side, you have 1 by root 3. CD is 30, AC will be AC. So, this is equal to 30 by AC. When you do the cross multiplication, AC into 1, is equal to 30 into root 3. AC 1s are AC. This is equal to 30 into root 3 is written as 30 root 3. So, by using the first triangle, we calculated A to C. 
Now, by using the second triangle, we will calculate C to B. Right? Now, let us consider the second triangle. What do we have here? We have angle 60 degrees. And for this 60, again this CD is again opposite side. I want to find CB. Once again, I will use tan. Can you put tan 60 degrees last name? So, tan 60 is opposite by adjacent. You could opposite CD, adjacent is CB. Tan 60 degrees is root 3 is equal to 30 by CB. Now, when, when you do the cross multiplication, you will have CB into root 3 is equal to 30 into 1. In the kind of root 3 can be written as root 3 by 1. So, right side you have 30 into 1, which is 30. CB in root 3 multiply as when you take it to the other side, it will actually divide. That means CB is equal to 30 by square root of 3. It learns situations man kind of good out. When you have an irrational number in the denominator, you have to do rationalization. And 30 by root 3 and a value ni, you have to multiply both numerator and denominator with root 3. So, in the numerator, you have 30 into root 3, 30 root 3. And in the denominator, we have root 3 into root 3. It is 3. So, this is equal to 30 root 3 by 3. Mani 3 is 30 lo 10 times. So that means, CB is actually equal to 10 root 3. We got both AC and CB. Now, the answer is very simple. If you add these two, you will get the distance between A and B. AB is AC plus CB, which is 30 root 3 plus 10 root 3. It's like 30A plus 10A. It is 40A. Similarly, 30 root 3 plus 10 root 3 is equal to 40 root 3. Therefore, distance between the two observers is actually 40 root 3 meter. Let us look at the example 7. A straight highway leads to the foot of a tower. Ramaya standing at the top of a tower observes a car at an angle of depression 30 degrees. So, here we have a straight road and the straight road is leading to a tower. And at the top of the tower, we have a person named Ramaya and he observed a car on the road with an angle of depression 30 degrees. The car is approaching the foot of the tower with uniform speed. Now, this car is actually approaching the tower. Six seconds later, the angle of depression of the car is found to be 60 degrees. Find the time taken by the car to reach the foot of the tower from this point. Right? So, this is a situation we have a straight road and this leads to the tower and we have Ramaya at the top of the tower. Okay? Tower kanna Ramaya anta peddaga eme unnadu. Manaki picture understand jayadun I have taken Ramaya like that. Now, here we have a car which is approaching this tower. Now, at this particular point, Ramaya observed that the angle of depression of the car is 30 degrees. Angle of depression gout, you have to draw the horizontal. Now, 6 seconds later, actually, car tower vaipu travel jasand. So, 6 seconds later, he found that the same car is making an angle of depression 60 degrees. Man, when you look at a tall object, ke anta unte, angle anta increase out of Right? So, a initial position launch, car ki place crowd on 6 seconds, padte, remaining distance travel jade on ki, a tower kit reach out on ki, e car ki inka anta time padthan do calculate jayal. So, here we have three values. First is angle of depression in the first position, angle of depression in the second position, and the time taken by the car to reach from position 1 to position 2. So, these three values use shares kuni. Manam, e purna position loan chi car tower ki reach a valente at the time partundo chapal. Here we have no lengths or no heights. As a tower height gani lak pata car yak initial distance traveled gani tlanti emi man dagir leo. But we have time taken by the car to reach from position 1 to position 2. Right? First, let us try to draw a diagram corresponding to this. So, this situation we have. This is a straight road. And this is a tower which is AB. So, AB is a, is a tower. A degra Rama yonad. Okay. C is the initial position of the car. So, the angle of depression, first angle of depression is actually 30 degrees. So, if you have an angle of depression 30 degrees, as thamo, automatically here angle ACB will be 30 degrees because there are alternate and interior angles. Now, after 6 seconds, suppose E is the position of the car. Now, in this case, the angle of depression is actually 60 degrees. So, if the angle of depression 60 is here at E also you have angle of depression 60 degrees. Now, C ninch E ki validani ka car 6 seconds is kunte E ninch B ki validani ka anta time padatun do manu calculate shayal. That is what you are going to do now. E car uniform speed to velton. Ante 
కార్ ట్రావెల్ చేయడానికి తీసుకునే టైమ్ డిస్టెన్స్ మీద డిపెండ్ అయి ఉంటుంది సో ఎక్కువ డిస్టెన్స్ ట్రావెల్ చేయాలి అంటే ఇట్ టేక్ ఇట్ విల్ టేక్ మోర్ టైమ్ సో మనం సి నుంచి ఈ కొన్న డిస్టెన్స్ కి ఇంకా ట్రావెల్ చేయాల్సిన డిస్టెన్స్ అంటే ఈ నుంచి బీకి మిగిలిన డిస్టెన్స్ కి గనక రిలేషన్ గనక మనం ఫైండ్ అవుట్ చేయగలిగినట్లయితే అప్పుడు మనం ఎంత టైం పడుతుందో క్యాల్కులేట్ చేయడం సో వీ హ్యావ్ టు ఎస్టాబ్లిష్ ఎ రిలేషన్ బిట్వీన్ సిఇ అండ్ ఈబి దట్ ఈస్ వాట్ వీ హ్యావ్ టు డూ లెట్ ఇస్ రైట్ వాట్ ఈస్ గివెన్ ఇన్ ద ప్రాబ్లమ్ ఏబి ఈస్ ద హైట్ ఆఫ్ ద టవర్ సి అండ్ ఈ ఆర్ ద ఇనీషియల్ అండ్ ఫైనల్ పొజిషన్స్ ఆఫ్ ద కార్ ఇనీషియల్ పొజిషన్ అంటే యాంగిల్ ఆఫ్ డిప్రెషన్ థర్టీ డిగ్రీస్ ఫైనల్ పొజిషన్ అంటే సెకండ్ పొజిషన్ అని అర్థం యాంగిల్ ఆఫ్ డిప్రెషన్ సిక్స్టీ డిగ్రీస్ నౌ యాంగిల్ డిఏసి ఈస్ యాంగిల్ ఆఫ్ డిప్రెషన్ ఆఫ్ ద కార్ వెన్ ద కార్ వాజ్ ఎట్ సి విచ్ ఈస్ ఈక్వల్ టు థర్టీ డిగ్రీస్ నౌ దిస్ యాంగిల్ డిఏసి ఈస్ యాక్చువల్ ఈక్వల్ టు యాంగిల్ ఏసిబి ఈ యాంగిల్ కి ఈక్వల్ రైట్ నౌ ద సెకండ్ యాంగిల్ యాంగిల్ డిఏఇ ఈస్ యాంగిల్ ఆఫ్ డిప్రెషన్ ఆఫ్ ద కార్ వెన్ ద కార్ వాజ్ ఎట్ ఈ నౌ దిస్ విల్ బి ఈక్వల్ టు సిక్స్టీ డిగ్రీస్ రైట్ యాంగిల్ ఏఈబి కి ఈక్వల్ అవుతుంది బికాస్ దే ఆర్ ఆల్టర్నేట్ అండ్ ఇంటీరియర్ యాంగిల్స్ నౌ టైమ్ టేకెన్ బై ద కార్ to reach e from c is actually 6 seconds ipudu manaku anukovalsindi e nunchi b ki enta time padutundo kanukovali now for that what we do is we'll take ce is equal to x and eb is equal to y manam ee x ki y ki relation find out cheyali that is what we are going to do now for that we'll consider the right angle triangles that we have here we have actually two right angle triangles first we'll consider this triangle abe here we have an angle 60 degrees and i want to know about this eb so for that i'll consider this height of the tower e height of the tower are two triangles ki common so so height of the tower ni use cheskuni relation establish chestam so let us take tan 60 here so tan is opposite by adjacent ab by eb we know that tan 60 is root 3 so on the left side you will have root 3 is equal to ab by y because i have taken eb as y cross multiply chesam ankonde ab into 1 is equal to y into root 3 or ab is equal to y root 3 take it as equation 1 so by considering triangle abe we got an equation that is ab is equal to y into root 3 now we'll consider the bigger triangle that is triangle abc ee triangle lo angle manaki 30 degrees okay forget about the interior triangle ippudu manaki interior triangle tho pan ledhu when you consider angle 30 let us write tan once again now we'll write tan 30 so tan 30 is opposite by adjacent opposite ab adjacent ikkada cb kani cb chusinatlayite meeru cb is actually sum of x and y e x and y ee rendu plus chesthe c nunchi b kona distance vastadi now on the left side tan 30 ante 1 by root 3 is equal to ab by x plus y malli cross multiply chesam ankonde ab into root 3 is equal to x plus y into 1 that means x plus on the right side you have x plus y into 1 ante x plus y ab in square root of 3 multiply yasthan at this kalit it will divide that means ab is equal to x plus y divided by square root of 3 this is equation 2 now when you observe equations 1 and 2 they have their left hand sides equal so eppadaithe two equations low left hand sides equal out there automatically right hand sides kode equal because things equal to the same thing are equal to one another according to euclid so eppadu manu right hand sides ni equal chayich from equation 1 and 2 first equation of right hand side you have y root 3 now this is equal to right hand side of the second equation is x plus y by root 3 you can actually root 3 divide just when you transpose it to the left side it will actually multiply and you put on the left side y root 3 into root 3 is equal to x plus y this is on the right side left side should be y root 3 into root 3 root 3 into root 3 is 3 so on the left side you have y into 3 we write that as 3y so 3y is equal to x plus y now we'll transpose plus y to the left side that means 3y minus y is equal to x 3y minus y is 2y that means 2y is equal to x or y is equal to x by 2 now this is the heart of this problem you can show it y is equal to x by 2 one which is the distance from e to b actually x low half and x and t c into e kuna distance and t కార్ ఆల్రెడీ జర్నీ చేసినటువంటి డిస్టెన్స్ లో హాఫ్ డిస్టెన్స్ కనుక ట్రావెల్ చేస్తే కారు టవర్ దగ్గరికి వెళ్ళిపోతుంది దీని మీనింగ్ అది ఆల్రెడీ ట్రావెల్ చేసిన డిస్టెన్స్ లో హాఫ్ ద డిస్టెన్స్ ఇప్పుడు ఇంకా ట్రావెల్ చేయాల్సి ఉంది ఆల్రెడీ ట్రావెల్ చేయడానికి కార్కి ఎంత టైం పట్టింది ఇట్స్ యాక్చువల్లీ సిక్స్ సెకండ్స్ మరి ఇప్పుడు జర్నీ చేయాల్సిన డిస్టెన్స్ హాఫ్ అందులో సో ఒక జర్నీకి సిక్స్ సెకండ్స్ పట్టింది అందులో హాఫ్ జర్నీ చేయడానికి ఎన్ని సెకండ్స్ పడుతుంది 
త్రీ సెకండ్స్ బికాస్ ద స్పీడ్ ఈజ్ యూనిఫామ్ యూనిఫామ్ స్పీడ్ తో వెళ్తుంది కాబట్టి కారు డిస్టెన్స్ అండ్ టైమ్ ఆర్ ఇన్ డైరెక్ట్ ప్రపోర్షన్ సో వెన్ ద డిస్టెన్స్ ఈజ్ హాఫ్డ్ టైమ్ ఆల్సో విల్ బి హాఫ్డ్ సో టైమ్ టేకెన్ టు ట్రావెల్ వైడ్ డిస్టెన్స్ ఈజ్ యాక్చువల్లీ సిక్స్ బై టూ విచ్ ఈస్ ఈక్వల్ టు త్రీ సెకండ్స్ సో ఈ కార్ గనక త్రీ సెకండ్స్ ట్రావెల్ చేసినట్లయితే ఆ టవర్ ని రీచ్ అవుతుంది సో ఇక్కడ మనకి లెన్స్ డిస్టెన్సెస్ హైట్స్ అట్లాంటివి ఏమీ ఇవ్వలేదు కానీ మనకి ఇచ్చిన ఇన్ఫర్మేషన్ యూజ్ చేసుకుని మిగతా జర్నీ చేయడానికి ఎంత టైం కావాలో మనం దాన్ని క్యాలిక్యులేట్ చేసాం రైట్ నౌ దిస్ ఇస్ యువర్ అసైన్మెంట్ ఫర్ టుడే సాల్వ్ దీస్ టూ ప్రాబ్లమ్స్ అండ్ పోస్ ద ఆన్సర్స్ టు మీ